Our ancestors have been recognizable as man for nearly three million years. And throughout this period, they've been unique among all other animals. One thing that has led to this distinction has been man's ability to produce tools. But he's only understood the use of metals for a few thousand years. Before this, all implements which needed a sharp edge had to be made from stone. These tools were not made by one man or even one generation of men. They cover a million or more years, from the old Stone Age, when man the hunter made chipped stone cutting tools, to the new Stone Age, when man the farmer made polished stone axes. Paleolithic, Neolithic, and Mesolithic, the Middle Stone Age, at the end of the era of the hunters and before the advent of the farmers. 10,000 years ago, and the world was very cold. We are at the end of the last of the great ice ages, but already there are signs of change. In spite of the intense cold, the ice fields are slowly retreating towards their points of origin. As the climate grew gradually warmer, billions of tons of water flowing from the ice fields raised the level of the ocean, slowly forming great new seas and millions of square miles of shallow marshes. 10,000 years ago, a map of Western Europe would have looked something like this. And although it was slowly approaching its modern shape, there were still great land bridges across which the animals and human populations could move at will. The great hairy animals that the men of the later Paleolithic drew on their cave walls were becoming extinct in this area as the climate became more temperate. 